In this video, we're going to learn how to print our A1s on an A3. Okay, so first things first, file. Okay, so if you go to print, if you want to print this as an A1 by default, you'll need to go to file, export, PDF. Okay, now with PDF, you're going to say current window, you're going to give this a name, and you're going to pick a location where to save this. I'm going to make it my desktop for now. Done. Okay, so now, if you want this to be an A1, for example, you're going to make it an A1, just like I'm doing over here. Scale 100%. Okay, don't use the fit page quality and you leave everything as it is like this. And I'm going to press export. Yes, you can save these settings. So you can save these settings for later. Yes, and call this A1. Good. Give it a couple seconds. And then on our desktop, we go to our desktop now you'll notice I'll have an A1 sheet set up correctly okay in the beginning your drawings are not going to look that great so we, we understand that but we will start fixing this information as time progresses okay so close that for now now if you want this to be an A3 so you're going to go control P again Sorry, my apologies. File, export, PDF. In this instance, we're going to say A3. It'll be on my desktop again. I'm going to give this a name. I'm going to go underscore A3. This is to print. So if you want to print upstairs in the, in the printer and you want it to print correctly, you're going to say site model A3. This you're going to change to an A3 size and this you're going to change to 50%. If I press OK now, you'll notice if I go to my desktop now, so let me just open up my desktop, my apologies, and I open this view, you'll notice that this is exactly an A3 size, okay, so this is the quickest and best way to do this, and make sure that you give this a name as A3, so that when you go upstairs, it'll print to A3, and the borders will be correct, that's important, okay, I hope this helped.